Hello beer fans, here Brent Company here. Welcome to my beer library where I do beer, seltzer, and cider reviews. Today we are trying, uh, we got a variety pack from Samuel Adams. So we're trying the first one of those. This is uh, Samuel Adams OVP. That stands for Oaked Vanilla Porter. This is 5.8% 5, 5 aqua volume and 35 IBUs. I love the lower IBUs. They taste less like hops and more like uh, um, flavor to me. So uh, OVP is complex and malty with a hearty warming character. This porter features notes of vanilla and oak, hints of coffee and a touch of sweetness. OVP just might be your holiday party's MVP. Tim Koch, founder and brewer. All right, let's go ahead and give it a go here. We'll let you use the, the bottle breacher. It's gonna be a twist up, huh? Nope. All right. Eager to. I'm not. I've never tried this one. I don't know how long it's been around. Um. So, but I'm eager to see. Does it taste like vanilla? So it smells kind of. Uh, Wheat beerish, and obviously it doesn't look like that at all. It's really dark, like a Guinness. Taste uh, dark, real dark. Man. That's good. That's real good. So. It has an, it does have like a, it's not an oaky aftertaste. It's more of a earthy. Yeah. So kind of that tannin wood. Uh, I don't, I mean, you know, I wouldn't be able to say like that's oak or that's, you know, something else. But I don't really taste a lot of the uh, vanilla in there. Um, more like porter-ish or stout-ish, I mean. Good, strong, thick, visceral flavor um, is what that is. So, pretty good. Uh, these are the types of beers that you drink. Like, you just went out and brought in wood and, uh, you know, it's cold and you want to warm up. But the, the ABV is kind of low for that. Um, like, I'll get a Christmas ale that is like 8 9%. And that's what I'll drink when I want to warm up. Um, so, And you can even take those out there with you. Pop them open. And uh, drive around and uh, load up wood in the back. Bring it to the house and have fun. Anyway. That's what, like, when I think of, like, a, uh, a, a Christmas ale. That's what I kind of think of. Um, this is not a Christmas ale. This is really, really strong. Um, a Christmas ale would be more like something with uh, spices and stuff like that in it. Um, this is would just be completely different. Same concept that what I would use it for. Anyways, so uh, on a scale of 1 to 10, or 1 to 100, uh, 1 being the worst, 100 being the best, I would give this a score of... I would give it a score of... Um, Probably like a, putting this in the um, the porter category, and and those of you know, uh, I also brew beer, and I brewed a porter. I actually brewed many porters. Porter is is my favorite one to brew, um, and so you can watch those videos. They're they're kind of old because I haven't recorded me making beer in a while, but you can watch those. So this is amazing compared to mine um so they did a really good job and uh i would give it a score of i'm gonna say 89 um so almost in that 90 mark the only thing that would make it uh more in the 90 mark is raise the abvs a little bit and then also pronounce more of the vanilla flavor um i don't taste it and usually vanilla is an easy one to smell and taste um <clears throat> so that's, that's the only thing I'm going to say about that. 
like, subscribe, share our, our videos and our channel. That's how the channel grows. Leave a comment. Tell me what you want me to try next. And also if you agree or disagree with what I just said. And uh, watch our other videos. we got a ton of other videos. And try something you never had before like I just did. Cheers.